Hey, what's up guys? If you guys could please like and subscribe, it would really help out my channel. Now, in terms of what we're talking about today, it's gonna be the Dunk Low Plum. This shoe is really important because it's a holy grail of mine and one of the more important dunks that I've wanted in my collection. This shoe originally released in 2001, originally as a Japan exclusive. So this is the first time it's ever been released for the US. It came along with two other shoes. That's the Veneers and the Ceramics. I think overall as a collector, it's one of the more proud moments of my life to actually have one of these shoes in my collection. And it's one of the shoes that I know a lot of dunk collectors actually want to get. Now in terms of some of the details that you can see in this shoe, the first thing that's going to catch your eye is strictly just the colorway. It's this beautiful plum with two shades of purple and it overall sits very well nice on this silhouette. The first thing you can also notice is going to be the quality of these materials. It's a beautiful buttery suede as you guys can see here. The next thing that I really enjoy about this shoe is the red bottom along with the white midsole. I like a red bottom because it allows you to actually wear the shoe and not damage the white midsole while still having the white, giving you a vast variety of colors that you guys can actually use. Now some of the other things that you're going to get with this shoe is the plum laces, which is the, the red ones, and you also get a white lace. However, I did a pink lace swap and it's one of the things that I, I really think look well on this shoe. I learned that from JD's Kicks and he did that lace swap and so I decided to do it too. Now the next thing is going to be the box. That surprised me because I think these are really special shoes and originally were supposed to be released for the Tokyo Olympics. I thought we would get a special box considering how big of a shoe the Ugly Duckling pack is in, in its entirety. But it is just a standard box as you guys can see here. Now that leads us to the market value. You're probably wondering what do these type of shoes cost? Now the Plum is the most expensive in the entire pack and it's going to be around 400 to $550 depending on that 10 to 11 and a half range. I personally got the 10 and a half which could lead to the sizing. The sizing is really awesome because regular dunks do fit true to size. Nike SBs fit a half size up I would say for most people but these are a true to size shoe. I would love to hear about some of the dunks you guys are collecting and I would like to know some of the other shoes that you guys are collecting in general. I'm trying to get into New Balance so I would like any suggestions. Alright guys, thank you. Please make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys later.